it's been a great experience. You know, now I'm on this side, you know, being up here in uh, Tempe, but I wouldn't change it for the world. What's it mean for you to have so many U of A fans still cheering for you even though you're here at ASU? Yeah, no, it's definitely been different, you know, growing up in Tucson, uh, but, you know, I'm glad I made the decision to come here, and it's been a blessing. Uh, that was former Marana High School standout quarterback Trenton Borgay last season after his Sun Devils knocked off his hometown team, the Wildcats, at ASU. Happy Thanksgiving to you. I'm Paul Sikala. It'll be a homecoming again for Trenton Borgay, who's scheduled to get the start at quarterback for ASU, this time at Arizona Stadium, where he grew up going to Wildcat games. It's the heated and hated rivalry on Friday at Arizona Stadium, with Marana's Trenton Borgay taking center stage. It'll certainly be an emotional reunion of a day for Miranda's very own Trenton Borgay as he returns to his home roots in Southern Arizona. It's no secret, Miranda's very own Trenton Borgay broke an ASU record earlier in the season with the most passing yards for a first time starter in school history. Against Colorado, Borgay threw for 435 yards and three touchdowns. And no matter how many snaps he gets this time around, Borgay knows it'll be a dream come true. Suiting up in the city he starred in in high school, but this time against the Arizona Wildcats. It's, a, it's really the biggest game of the week, a biggest game of the year um, for the season. And you know, you know, like Kyle, like X, you know, if people can play with that effort, you know, that emotion, and you know, we'll come out victorious. And we got to lock in and play for one another, and you know, put it on for Arizona State. Even Borgay's teammates and coaches know how big it is for the hometown kid to return. In this case, as the villain leading up ASU's offense. I try not to bring it up to him. Um, uh, because I didn't want to put the uh, added pressure on him, but uh, he knows uh, I'll kind of walk by him. I said, hey, we're going to go uh, downtown to your neck of the woods. And he was like, coach, we're going to win. I know what it means to him to go down there and, and come away with a win. Um, and so uh, I won't uh, have that conversation. I'll just give him a little uh, teasing nudges out here and there during the week. But uh, he'll be prepared and he'll be ready. Ready for another Territorial Cup and reuniting with some old friends after the game. But until then, It'll be all business, not only for Borgay, but also for Coach Jed Fish and the Arizona Wildcats who hope to end Arizona's season on a positive note. Hey, bear down, and of course, it's hard to forget thousands of ASU grads also live right here in Tucson. So divided it up, baby. All right, kickoff is set for 1 p.m. at Arizona Stadium. Also, Trenton's brother, Coben Borgay, is a walk-on wide receiver with ASU, so it's a homecoming for both. For more in-depth coverage on the Territorial Cup over the last week, we have much, much more on KVOA.com and KVOA's YouTube page. Meanwhile, 